Moore Street. One of the best known outdoor markets in Dublin is in Moore Street. It is famous for its meat, fish, fruit and vegetable stalls, as well as the Dublin wit of its traders, which means they might say something smart to you that'll make you laugh. The street takes its name from Henry Moore. The Moore family came to Ireland in the 16th century. They became owners of the land around St Mary's Abbey, which was located off what is now Cable Street and the surrounding area. In the 18th century, they decided to divide their land by building streets through it. Now, Henry Moore, who was the Earl of Drogheda, felt he was an important man, and he called four of these streets after himself. Moore Street, Henry Street, Earl Street, and Drogheda Street. Drogheda Street was called Sackville Street later on, and then became our O'Connell Street. In the 19th century, Moore Street became famous for its victuallers, poultry shops, and butchers. A victualler is an old word for a grocery shop. Soon the number of fruit and vegetable stalls increased, and Moore Street became the largest market in Dublin. One of the people who lived in Moore Street at the beginning of the 20th century was Seamus Scully. His father had a butcher shop at number 31, and Seamus describes what life was like growing up there. He says he could hear his father bargaining with, with the women over the price of pig's cheek, backbones and ribs, etc. Number 16, Moore Street, was the last headquarters of the 1916 Rising. The surviving leaders held their last meeting there before they surrendered. There were many other markets around Moore Street. The Rotunda Market, Taft's Market, the Norfolk Market, and Anglesey Market, which was famous for second-hand clothes, shoes and furniture. In 1972, all these markets were removed and the Ilac Centre was built in their place. Moore Street still exists and thrives. Lately, many people who have come from abroad to live in Ireland have started businesses in Moore Street and sell their types of food there.